Hey guys, what's up? So today I'm going to be doing a full two doll outfit using only outfits that I hate, clothes that I hate. But I don't know, I saw a lot of and like something illogical doing this oh a long time ago. And I thought I would do it with doll outfits. So I'm going to give each of these girls a completely full outfit from the head to their toes using only things I dislike and if, if I dislike it I've, you know, I've gotten rid of most of the stuff because if you don't like something it just doesn't really make sense to keep it and also I'm going to only be using like doll print things like organization American girl things not something that like I made or that wasn't made for me to make all because that wouldn't really make sense obviously it's not made for me to make it's not gonna work on that so I got Amelia and yeah, so I don't know if this outfits are going to necessarily match. The first thing I really hate, also I know my nails are bad, but let me talk about it, is Kit's clip. Try saying that ten times fast. Um, because it just, it breaks all the time. Like, I've never been able to use it without it breaking. It's, it's, it's actually broken right now, I'm just like... See that little piece? It just comes out of it a lot. So, I guess I probably should put this on Kit, but that's fine. Do what? Clip her hair back with it. That is really the worst clip in the job I've ever done in my job. This thing is a shirt from the Springfield collection, and it has like an overshirt, but I don't have that anymore. And it like has such a weird fleece. It's like a muscle take, but you're not supposed to wear anything under it. So I'm very confused about it. And the velcro is also like really hard to undo and it like isn't no snag velcro so it snags a lot of things and it's just not ideal so I'm going to put it on Amelia and it's just it's not great. I'm almost done and you can like look at that like that is such a low weird oddly cut thing and like you can't really just wear it by itself just because like that it looks so weird I just I don't understand what they're trying to do. Like how hard would it have been just sort of fix it? I don't know. Moving on, these pants are also from the Springfield collection. They're inside out. You can't really see them yet. I'll, and they're just really ugly. <laughs> and they stain the doll's legs. And there's a hole in them. And they I only use them like once. But yeah, they stain the doll's legs. That's the worst thing. So we're not going to use those. Instead, I have these ones which are, I don't really even know. I think they're probably Springfield. And they look so weird. I don't know. What am I doing? Why am I? Like there's like a weird extra flap on top like extra stuff so i'm gonna dress amelia you can just kind of see the weird little flap see like a pull on it like that's just unnecessary it's kind of in the back too and so like i don't even know how to pull it or down like do i need to cover the flap do i need to not cover the flap like i don't understand and then you pull a shirt over it and it looks like she's like pregnant or just ate a really big dinner so it's not a cute look like a jacket and this next thing isn't really a jacket but i'm using it anyway and i got this at a craft fair and was made for 18 inch dolls i didn't pick it out myself but it just it's so weird like i don't understand it looks like a pajama shirt but it's not meant for it to be a pajama shirt and it's just it's weird looking i don't even know i hate front velcro shirts because i feel like it always looks really fake and i just i don't even know i just i just think it looks weird it's just like it's hard to velcro properly because the velcro it's not even like it's nicely made i just don't understand the like top collar part is it supposed to be a flannel i don't really know next things are tenny's boots and i didn't mean for this to turn into like a country look but i really dislike tenny's boots i don't know i feel like they're kind of hard to get on and they always look sort of crinkly and just like big and bulky and the dolls don't really stand up properly in them so i have a lot of issues with them Amelia's look looking snazzy looking fabulous I'd messed up her hair on purpose because I think it it sort of goes with the look you know messy hair don't care I just it's so weird and you can't even really see the flab of the pants but it just is ugly <laughs> so starting her look starting it off with this headband from our generation that is way too big for the doll's hair i use it on addy because she has so much hair so it works on her but it's like so big and it just doesn't even fit at all see like i can just sort of it, it falls over her head and i put it on it just it does it's not the right size and our generation's heads aren't that much bigger so i don't really know why we're having that issue with it i think it could be really cute but no <laughs> to film like a before of this shirt but 
It's from Justice's 18 inch doll line. And I don't really dislike it that much. The back is weird and it doesn't have no snag velcro, but the back makes it just have like a weird tail thing. I just really hate the style of it because I picked it out myself a long time ago when I still was into Justice. Those were, those were dark times. So yeah. Sort of like see this little weird tail thing. Like it just like that's weird. Why did it stick out like that? You can't really tuck it in into anything then because of it. So don't not a huge fan. These pants that are the spawn of Satan, they look, look so cute, right? Third generation, I thought they had a cute vintage feel, but they are so small, they don't even fit on the doll. And I obviously haven't tried them on our generation, maybe they'll fit on them, but I don't have our generation girls. These just do not fit. Like, you can get them over the feet with a lot of struggle, but they don't fit over the, like, <laughs> leg. And I'm just like, they'd be so cute. I want my Angelica doll to wear them, but no, nope. Thanks for generation. <laughs> See that during the struggle to put on these pants, Eliza's headband will fall off in like 0.3 seconds. And it's great because like, it just shows it's too big, right? Yeah, and the pants don't fit. So you know what? I'm not even, I'm just going to leave it like that. You know, it's like a gangster look. Like, <laughs> honestly though, I why did I waste my money on these? Uh, I don't really hate this, this jacket. I used to use it a lot. It's from Springfield. Um, in the Springfield collection, I just kind of a weird length um and it's just it's really ugly <laughs> and it i guess it's kind of hard to get over her hands because i can't really do it here but i feel like i used to do it just fine so maybe i'm just being becoming more dumb from being out of school for so long i don't really know see i just i struggled <laughs> a lot with putting it on and so i just leave it draped it, like it's an aesthetic you know so it's cute like it's a cute look the next one I want to show is this little choker, and I thought it'd be really cute for Adelaide. I got it off of uh, an Etsy shop. Uh, I have an opening video, but I don't remember where. And it literally broke the day of. I kind of just showed it like it came, the Velcro came undone. The choker itself looks fine, it's just I'm so scared to use it because of the Velcro. So these shoes are a generation, they're their courts, they're whole plastic, and I literally cannot get them on the American Girl shoe feet, whatsoever. Our generations have kind of squishy feet, at least I used to, so maybe it would work on them. But, like, I can't get it on my dolls, and I'm just like, <laughs> okay. But I was literally struggling to put on one for, like, five minutes, and I, I still couldn't do it. You should can't really, like, I'm still struggling to put it on. I even put it on the bed to see if it'd be easier. I just don't get how you can even put these on any doll, because our generations don't even have squishy feet anymore, so I don't really understand. She, and her pants are about to fall off, because they're not even on all the way. She can't stand up. I just leaned her against the wall. And here's a close-up of how the shoes are looking. It looks like her feet are broken. Scarf that I forgot I wanted to put on Amelia, so, because I really dislike it, because it's Velcro and just not film the rest of this video, and I'm not getting my filming equipment back out. I see equipment, it's literally my desk chair, my makeup light, and like this weird metal oven, but yeah, here's here's the scarf on her. It doesn't look that bad, I just feel like it's a weird length and it like bunches up really weirdly and like, oh, she just looks like a queen though, how is this possible? Um, so here are these outfits that I hate, and um, <laughs> yeah, I feel like some of these pieces are just foul. I feel like with more pants that are just valuably terrible, and here's things. But I feel like the shirts, the jackets, in one pair of shoes really weren't that bad. I was being class and figure and over exaggerating. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Did I just see y'all? And um, I'll see y'all in the next video.